Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we're going to be working on a Ford F-150 2003 Super Crew and replace the front grille. Stay tuned. First thing we're going to do is locate this front tab and lift it up and pull the headlight assembly out. You can push it from the back and lift forward. And this one here off to the side and the headlight should push out. Once you have these two tabs pulled up, set those aside and out should come your front left headlight. Go ahead and disconnect it this way and set the light off to the side. Okay, you're going to remove this one as well and the front one to remove the other front headlight. Out comes that and then you can unplug it the light from the headlight and with a seven millimeter socket and ratchet wrench and extension remove the screw above the turn signal and once the top screw up here has been removed go ahead and pull forward the turn signal like that and disconnect the the retainer clip from the light like that and you'll do the same for the other side and remove the connector for the other tail light okay we're going to remove the tire iron from the above the radiator they're held on by these three clips set that aside and with two screwdrivers, go ahead and pry up the remaining clips. Come underneath it like this and pop it up. So this one will come from the top. Open it up with the screwdriver. Slowly start prying it up, just like that. Pop it out like that. Once you have those removed, you'll have one, two, three, four, five, and then two above the radiator fan shroud, six and seven. You can go ahead and remove the cover. Remove that cover from the top. There's going to be 10 screws that holds the grill to the front. Here's one, two over here, you're going to have two over here, six on the top. Five and six. Okay, once we get the ten screws undone on both sides, this side and this side, there are going to be two more clips. You're going to have to pop those out. Take your little crossbar foot, foot tool inside and pry down. So we have the two on this side down. Took my crowbar, popped it down. We'll go to the other side. This side in here, pull down this side, pull, pull straight down, and this side, pull straight down. Okay, so you're gonna start pulling it straight out. There's two clips behind this grill, and it's gonna come out like that. Set it down. And once we have the grill out of the truck, you're gonna go ahead and rem remove these two pieces on both sides. There's one over here, one in here, and you're gonna remove these four clips. One, two, three, four. And when you go ahead and reinstall it on the new one, we'll just make sure that the two are sticking out on the end. And with some spray lubricant, we'll spray the bolts. Penetrating oil. With a 10 millimeter socket, 
We'll go ahead and remove the nuts on the back side, retaining the Ford emblem. And you should be able to remove it just like this. Okay, so we can set the old one aside. Okay, so the next process is gonna be uh, installation. We got everything ready for installation. We're gonna go ahead and install the Ford emblem. And with a small quarter inch drill bit, we'll have to drill a hole for the emblem here to go on. Then once the hole is drilled, we should be able to set it on just like that and run our two nuts in the back. All right, now we have the emblem tight. We'll go ahead and flip this around and put on our windbreaker pieces. And grab our piece and set it down. Line up the holes. Go ahead and push these plastic pieces in like this. And you'll do this for the other side as well. You want to make sure that the two are left out. And with the new grill, we have two new retaining clips. So underneath here, we'll have to remove the old ones. And these just push back like this. And they pull out from the back side. And just push them through, just like that. All right, next, once you have your grill set into position, go underneath. And you're gonna take your clip like this and press it over the edge. Okay, once you press your tabs onto the chrome tabs here, your clips, go ahead and push it into the in, just like that. Add your two screws and the two screws for the other side of the light housing and the six on top okay so now we have our ten screws on we're gonna go ahead and set the cowl back back on we're gonna take our clips and put the two back onto the radiator and the rest on the top adding the passenger side blinker go ahead and Connect your plug back on, like that. And then this section and the bottom section, you're gonna slide this here and this here. You wanna make sure it sl slides into the groove and, and snaps in, just like that. And add your seven millimeter screw. Installing the front headlight and then go ahead and replace it as you removed it. And there you have it a new grill installed on the Ford F 150. A couple connectors, clips, and connections to be made uh, with a couple screws, and you can have a nice front grill on your, uh, your older F 150. If you like this video and it helped you install your grill on your F-150, check out some of my other videos that may be helpful to you. And always subscribe. Thank you for your time and watching.